blue blocking lenses, how to choose the best one for you. Hey folks, good morning. It's Dr. Sam and I'm on my walk today and I wanted to talk about blue blocking lenses. So I want to talk about some research. Uh, the Journal of Chronobiology came out with a study which said that people who do screen time have a higher risk of sleep disruption and that this begins to suppress their melatonin which is very important for balancing our circadian rhythms for sleep. Now there was another study that was published in the Review of Oncology which said that people that have lower melatonin levels have a higher risk for cancer. And then the third study I want to report on was done by the Paris Vision Institute which said that people that work on screens and that are more exposed to blue light radiation, they would uh, have a higher risk for uh, cell death, especially in the macula area, and be more susceptible to macular degeneration. So there's lots of blue blocking lenses out there. there. How to choose? Well, my recommendation would be during the day to get yourself a very light yellow tinted uh, pair of blue blocking lenses. Uh, these work well in offices and during the daytime. And then at night, I would get a amber, orange, uh, darker tint that you would use that would uh, block more of the blue light. And this would be important because of uh, sleep. And my recommendation would be to use those in the evening and then to stop working on digital devices, if you can, about two hours before you go to bed. And then the third type of blue blocking glasses would be the wraparounds. And again, I would probably get the darker amber orange uh, tint. And of course, this is going to block the blue light from the sides. So you're going to get more protection that way. Now, in terms of companies, I want to, first of all, have a disclaimer by saying I have no financial interest in any of the companies that I'm recommending. Number one would be Felix Gray. Number two would be Uvex. Uh, number three would be Swanies. And number four would be Duco. Do your due diligence in terms of homework, but at least these will give you a guideline. I would also make sure you get out enough natural sunlight every day and make sure you're supplementing with at least 10 milligrams of lutein per two milligrams of zeaxanthin, this will protect your macula.